am Real Jeanette Demon, and this is the 20p Arcade Challenge. The rules are simple, 20p or two credits, practice as much as you like, but your first recorded run is your run. This week we're playing Bonanza Brothers. Now, I'm not entirely sure which version of this is, in the sense of, did the Mega Drive version come out before the arcade version, or did the arcade version come out before the Mega Drive version? I'm not entirely sure, but basically this is like a souped-up Mega Drive with... with um, as a board for an arcade, and this is the game that kind of goes with it. It's basically two two weird looking thieves, and I think this is related to other sort of. Um, I think they've got some question and puzzles, pull games, and other things that use these two characters. But anyway, um, so what we need to do is we need to put two credits in. So we'll do that because because we, we can do our runs, and I'm going to do the training to show you the, what you have to do. So training stage, and it basically shows us what to do. So first, target. Ah, the money. So we need the money on the training stage, right? Okay, so um, we can move up and down on left and right with the joystick. It's going to tell us how to do that. So it's like a multiplane. So it's like that, look. Right? And then we shoot, and it knocks him out. And then we're going to go up there like that. And now we've got to wait while he goes down there. And he's going to look the, lo the wrong way. And then you shoot him when he's looking the wrong way. And... He won't notice while we're looking that way, because it's, it's all about which way they're, they're, they're looking, to be honest with you. You can hide on the stairs like this. That's what we're doing. And these guys won't look because they're looking the wrong way, so he's looking outside and the other one's sleeping. So we should be able to sneak past them, and then we grab the grab, grab the grab the cash. So we'll go past. Get the treasure and escape. So that's the aim of the game, it's grab the treasure and escape. I don't know which one of the Bonanza Brothers we are, but, but we are a Bonanza Brother. And then we basically escape up the way into the whole thing. It's like a two-player game because it's split screen, actually. It's quite clever. So um, then we have to rob it for real. So that was our training stage. That was our, that was our um, um, is it Pink Panther type approach. You know, where you got to be the, 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 the criminal. It's probably more Inspector Clouseau or, or something else. But anyway, piles of money now. So, so this is the this is the this is what we got to do. So let's. Uh, I'm going to wait for him to change direction, and I'm going to shoot him. I'm going to grab the money. I'm going to go this way while he's lying on his back. Go on, move away. Is it landed up, fly landed on my head. There we go. Get that way. Got to get this cash quickly while he's not looking. And then wait for him to turn around because he's gonna he's gonna he's got a little he's got a little shooter. Oh Okay. I think oh go the wrong way actually. I need to go back this way. Wait for this guy. There's a fly gonna land on my head again. I'm gonna run out of time actually if I'm not careful here. Got him anyway. No, wait, wait, wait for him. Wait for it. Got him. Up through the door. How do I climb this? I don't know how to climb these things. That's what happened to me before. I played this before and I got stuck and I couldn't work out how to climb it. Was there a button to climb it? I don't know. Uh, how do I get up there? Yeah. Open the door. He's going to stay there. Oh god. I don't know how to get I don't know how to get to get up the level here. I'm up the level now, but that's no good. Well that's kind of not the really way the way to do it, but anyway. Okay, come on. Change direction. Oh he's coming. Yeah, I'll do, do that. That'll do. 
Hurry, running out of time. I don't know what's doing wrong there. How do you get up those little platforms? That's really annoying. I've got out though. I've got out. I'm, I'm, I made it to the next stage, so that was really kind of annoying. Almost ran out of time. <laughs> The Millionaire's Mansion, right, okay, let's have a look at the Millionaire's Mansion. Next target. Ah, all of these lovely trinkets. Bomb. Oh. How do I jump up there? I've got a jump button. Oh, I've got a jump button. Blummin' heck. I did not know there was a jump button. Oh, game over, I've died. We've been killed too many times. I didn't know there was a jump button. Bloody me in hell. Bloody me in hell. Oh my god. I'm just I'm just charging through the levels now. I'm not even not even tempting to do anything with them, am I? I'm, I'm assuming this is the millionaire. He's obviously not very happy that I've broken into his house and stole his stole his stuff, his stuffage. Um, oh, of course, I'm not going to be able to go back that way. I don't know who he is, but he's he's got punched in the face repeatedly with my little trumpet gun. Oh, come on! All right, okay. Can I shoot the dog? They're all sleeping. Weird people sleeping. Come on then. Oh God. I died. Oh god, that was that was dreadful. That was torture. I li quite literally, that was torture. I did dreadfully there. But it's quite a good game. It's quite a different game actually for the arcade. Uh, it's more. I would call it more home console than I would actually call it an arcade sort of title. But it's pretty good. It's different. It's definitely different. It's it's not one that I've ever got really into. But but it was different. It's definitely different. I got to stage two. I did all right. I did all right. There you go. Anyway, I've been your host, Real Genetic Demon. Thank you for watching. Please feel free to like and subscribe. And I'll catch you in the next video. Bye-bye now.